Hey guys, I wanted to show you how to set your profile picture as a full image, whether it's on your profile page or a business-like page. Now, first, I'm going to go over here and click on Add Photo. If you already have one there, say Update Photo. And this only seems to work on desktop. So if you're a mobile-only user, unfortunately, you can't do this. So now I'm going to go to... You can browse through any albums that you already have here. You can upload a photo, you can take a photo, you can tag photos. I'm going to go ahead and go through my tag photos and keep going. It's a specific picture I'm looking for. Sorry, guys. All right. Go ahead and select the photo I want. As you can see here, it's already set up to do the square crop. Um, like I said, I'm going to show you how to do it where it shows a full image. You just go down here to click on skip cropping. As you see, it says uh, the entire photo will be saved as your profile picture. Now you can actually set up the thumbnail. So you can either drag to either side. You can actually zoom in and out if you only want a certain part. Let's say this is what you want to show on your thumbnail. Go ahead and click Save. As you see, my picture was updated here. If I click on that, it shows the full image that was taken. Now you can do this for your own pages. Um, you took a picture of a client, model, um, anything you take a picture of and for some reason they want to do the crop thumbnail, you can show them this method. If they have access to a desktop, they can set it up as a full image. Why not show it the full image if you have the availability to do that? Alright, so I'm going to switch over to my like page and do the same thing. So I'll click here to change the profile picture and I'm going to choose from photos I already have uploaded. Go through models, go down, select the photo I want to use, skip cropping, and zoom into what I want to actually set up. Alright, just click on save. And if I click on this, once again, it shows a full image instead of just a little crop thumbnail. So once again, if anyone wants to use one of your images for whatever reason, especially if you watermark your images and you don't want them to crop it out, you can show them this method. All right. Thank you, guys.